And I think there's this kind of image that people are being hysterical about it. Come and spend some time in a house where somebody got a fetal alcohol spectrum disorder. And then I don't think you'd think that anymore. I think it's really difficult that there isn't more awareness about FASD and more acknowledgement of it. There was a study recently that found that it could affect up to 17% of children. So it's, it's a huge, huge issue, and yet no one's heard of it, pretty much. It can feel really a, like a lonely place if pe no one else acknowledges or even knows about it. I just wanted him to be typical, mm -hmm. and I was kind of not aware of how he wasn't really. There was quite a lot of lashing out, sometimes at staff and other children. It was just like this kind of volcano sometimes in the room. One of the sort of red flags quite early on as well was when he started to say his first words. He was starting to say about 10 words maybe, albeit very indistinctly. I remember he just stopped saying those first words and I remember being really concerned about that and I would try so hard to get him to say those words again and he just wouldn't. It was like they'd been wiped. You know, his behaviour was often not typical and trying to sort of cover over that and, and you know, pretend everything was normal was starting to get really stressful. So yeah, we started looking into it and, and when you first look at, look at it, it's really scary. And you start to understand that your child has got permanent brain damage. That's really distressing and there's a lot of grief involved in that. He is, in so many ways, an amazing little boy. He's such, such a survivor. He's really loving and affectionate and a beautiful little boy. Once you see the effects, it drives me absolutely insane to see people saying, oh, just, you know, the odd drink's fine, and that's something we really need to get through and get across to people. And once you understand the extent of the damage that it can do and the real consequences for the child and for the family, you just think, this is just ridiculous that people don't understand this.